Hey, what's up? I would like to welcome you back to my channel. If you're new here, I want to welcome you. Welcome. Thank you for stopping by. Um, I just want to let you know that you're reading the news with Camilla Bassett. Because you're in the news. And I'm going to keep you in the know. Now, if you're new here, I want you to go ahead and press that subscribe button. And go ahead and tap that notification bell if you already have it. Now, um, this was a lot on my desk. Um, I'm not going to keep you here long. I just want to let you know what's going on out here in these streets. Um, now, <clears throat> this is actually an update on the game. Um, now, you know the woman accusing the game of sexual assault that claims he's, she claims that he's transferring assets after losing the lawsuit. Um, now, the woman accusing the game of sexual assault has filed new legal documents in court after the rapper lost an appeal of the case, Now, which was ruled in her favor. Um, according to legal documents obtained by XXL on Wednesday, which was May 20th, Priscilla Rainey, um, who was awarded $7.0 judgment in her sexual battery case against the rapper the compton native back in november which is the game november of 2016 filed claims on may 15 accusing the rapper known as the game um of transferring some of his assets to a manager whack 100. Now, her accusations allege that the rapper is trying to shield and hold on to his assets to avoid paying her this money. Now, attorney Christina Vincent's beard, who represents Rainey, uh, wrote in the filing that the 40 year old rapper who was born Jason Taylor transferred ownership of his home by Grant D for his company. Now JTT Holdings to his manager Cash Jones, also known as WAC 100 um, on October 3rd of 2019. Now there was no taxes paid on the house because it was considered a bona fide gift and the guarantor received nothing in return. Now, according to the documents then on November 15, 2019, the rhymer assigned the trademark to his rap monkeyer, the game, to Wax 100 companies, Pass Go To Win LLC company. Now, in separate legal documents from May 15, uh, the woman filed a restraining order against the game to prohibit him from, um, from assigning, disposing, spending, or interfering with any rights to the payment or property due or to become due from BMI, which is prod, prod, Podcast Music Incorporated, which is the holder of the music royalties in the state of California. Um, restraining orders can be filed to prevent the transferring, selling, hiding, borrowing against getting rid of or destroying any property. Um, <clears throat> Now, the court documents also indicate that the 7.1 million judgment that Rainey was granted has now increased to 7.2 million after not being paid from the 7.1 million. Um, in April, Rainey was given control over the rapper's independent record label, L.A. Profilic. Now, last year, the rapper spoke on the case shortly after losing the appeal. Um, during his performance at the whole at the how the west was one concert at the five points amphitheater in ivern california he expressed little concern over the legal matter so he's really he expressed really like he wasn't bothered over this whole legal uh 7.1 million uh, that he has to pay out to this lady now everybody got something to say this is that game said at this time at the time i don't give a f about none of that i've been in the game my whole career i ain't deterred i'm me today i read on the internet <clears throat> Brothers, they say I lost seven million, which isn't crap to him. What I'm gonna do now is Pie Pie hiring. Pie Pie is hiring. Seven million, he must be broke. Um, 
Rainey sued the game in 2015 after after um claiming he sexually assaulted her during an on and off camera date while filming his reality show um uh, She's Got Game. Now XXL has reached out to a rep for the game for a comment, but they haven't received a comment yet. Um <clears throat> It seems like what the game is doing here is he's um, hiding that set. Oh, he, he, he's playing like 7.1 million. It's not enough. It's, it's not a lot. But now they then went back and tacked on one more million. So he has to pay this girl to 7.2 million. But it looks like he's she's claiming that he's hiding assets. He doesn't want her... Um, Obviously, he doesn't want to pay her this money, so the game is probably trying to find any kind of way to get out of paying this girl any kind of cash, uh, which is which is kind of sad. Like he said, he's been in this game, this career, uh, he's been in this rap game a long time, so he ain't. He, he ain't new to this, he just grew to this. So I'm pretty sure that the game is gonna find ways and means to try to get out of paying this girl 7.2 million. You know what I'm saying? He's he's gonna try to find ways not to pay her. You know, and he haven't he haven't coughed it up yet. Now he's he's basically bagging out. He's he's basically hiding assets. Saying he didn't own this house anyway. He didn't own the rights to his music in the first place. So basically it seems like she got the bad end of the stick. Probably like she's gonna. Uh, it seems like she's gonna walk away with nothing from the way it looked like it's going. Cause, like I said, game say he been in this game, meaning that he he got he he, he probably got some maneuvers around this. He probably got some ways not to um, eventually end up paying this girl all of this money. I mean, that's a lot of money. I mean, I mean, I'm pretty sure he worked hard for all that money. You know what I'm saying? I'm sure he has been rapping, making, making album after album, single after single, and then to turn around and get sued by somebody talking about she, um, he, um, supposed to sexually uh, abuse her, which which he probably did. I'm not saying that the allegations are fake or or true but what it is is that she did take it to court and obviously she did beat it um the game i don't know i would I, I would i mean just hand her over what she needs because it seems like this is going to turn out into an all-out war and it, it might not be good for you and it might not be good for her it's just bad for business all the way around the border um it's just business. It's just bad for business all the way around the border. I mean, I'm sorry, game, but that's a lot of money. I mean, I wouldn't want to pay it either. I would probably be trying to find every every nook and cranny, every you know, every way not to pay this girl all this money either. You know what I'm saying? Really? Seven point what, girl? Bye. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Chill, chill. Go, you know. I mean, this man got kids and everything, but maybe, yeah, he should have thought about it, what he did before he did it. And then he wouldn't have himself in his hot seat trying to figure out how he going to pay this girl. Now he, now he trying to find every way, way to drop the ball. You know what I'm saying? He don't want to pay this money. You know? Who would, though? 7.1, and then they, they kicked it up one more notch, so now she, he owed his child 7.2. Woo! Let me just, let me just think on that. Yeah, I be hiding shit too. Yeah, get go. You hiding that. I be hiding stuff too. You know, that's just that's just my opinion. That's just my take on it. You know what I'm saying? Everybody got opinion. It's like a open end from the from the rear end. But you know, um, yeah, I I wouldn't be trying to pay up one red cent either, for real. But um the game just the game. <laughs> the game you're trying to get out of it I, I i get it i get it i get it drop in the comments down below what would you do if somebody uh, sued you this talking about sexual harassment if and, you know the judge must decide with them and now you got to pay all this out what would you do you know what i'm saying drop in the comments below or how you would handle this situation or how would you try to um you know deal with this situation you know handing somebody over all my life's work hard hard earned money over over a claim that you claim stemmed from 2015 i don't know you know i don't know it's just i don't know all right so uh, i'm gonna go ahead and just 
just drop in the comments below. Let me know how you feel about this whole situation. But this is an update on the game, um, the game on this girl, all this money. I just want to tip you in the news of what's going on with the game. Um, now, um, the song that you hear playing is yours truly. I am God's greatest creation. Now, I want you to go and stream that and, um, Let's make that a number one here. How about we put that on the billboards? Because it's sung by me. It's written by me. It's called I Am God's Greatest Creation. And I know that you and you and you and you and you and everybody around the board is too. So um, go ahead and look it up at www.carmelabakes.com. Now that's K-E-R-M-A-L-A. Bakes, B-A-T-E-S. Carmelabakes.com. That one song, you can go to all streaming major major outlets which is Spotify, Deezer, Apple iTunes, Google Play, um, even title, just type in my name, Carmela Bates. Look for I Am God's Greatest Creation. Go ahead and download it only for one dollar. Now, until then, I will be keeping you, guess what? Cause you read the news with your girl Carmela Bates, yeah. Cause you read the news until the next video. I will see you. Peace.